Good day everyone. So welcome again to our math classroom with your teacher, Jordan. Okay, so for today's video, we're going to study the area of a circle. So you have learned from the previous lessons that the distance around a circle is called the circumference. Meanwhile, if we want to know the space covered by the interior of the circle, it is called the area of a circle, which is the number of square units inside the circle. So to begin to explain each uh, one of these examples, so we're going to use the formula of finding the circle, which is area of the circle, which is a is equal to pi times r squared. So we can say the square of, uh, of r is can be written as area uh, is equal to pi times r times r. So 2r. We multiply the 2r that is the formula in finding the area of a circle, which we study also the value of pi in our previous uh, video, that pi is equal to 3.14. So that is the rounded uh, value of a pi. So let's begin with question number one. So we have 5 inches. Okay, so 5 inches is our radius of our circle, so the radius is equal to 5 inches. So first we're going to write the formula, which is area is equal to pi r squared, which is equal to the value of pi is equal to 3.14 times r, which is 5, times another pi okay so we're going to multiply uh, five times five we get we get 25 and we're going to multiply 3.14 by 25 in a vertical way so we have 3.14 times 20 so we're going to use first 5. So 5 times 4 is 20 every 2. 5 times 1, 5 plus 2, you get 7. And 5 times 3, that is 15. And then we're going to use 2, the second digit. 2 times 4, that is 8. We're going to put 8 here in the tenth place because 2 is in the 10th place. 2 times 1 is 2. And then 2 times 3, you get 6. And then we're going to add the 2 product. Okay, 0, bring down 0. 7 plus 8, that is 15. Carry 1. 1 times, uh, 1 plus 5 is 6 plus 2, that is 8. And then 1 plus 6, that is 7. So counting again the number of decimal places in our factor, we have two decimal places. So therefore, we're going to move two decimal places in our product. So our area here for number 1, so the area of the circle with the radius of 5 is equal to 78. And... 5, 10, and we're going to write the unit. Okay, so unit, which is inches, and we're going to put square. So we can read that as area is equal to 78.5 square inches. Okay, that is the answer for question number one. Okay, let's proceed to question number two. So our radius here is equal to Four inches. 
So, they were going to write the formula which is A is equal to pi r squared. So, the value of pi again is 3.14 times the radius which is 4 times 4, 2 radius. So, we copy 3.14. 4 times 4, you got, you get 16. So, times 16. And then, we're going to multiply vertically 3.14 times 16. Okay, so 6 times 4, you get 24. Carry 2. 6 times 1, 6 plus 2, we get 8. 6 times 3, we get 18. And then, we have the second digit, which is 1. 1 times 4, that is 4. 1 times 1, that is 1. 1 times 3, that is 3. And then, we're going to add the two product. Bring down 4, 8 plus 4, that is 12. Carry 1. 1 plus 8, 9 plus 1, you get, we get 10, carry 1. 1 plus 1, 2 plus 3, we get 5. So we have 2 decimal also, so we're going to move 2 places, 2 decimal places going to the left. So the area here for number 1 is equal to 50.24. And we have inches square, square inches. So that is our answer for number two. For number three, the given here is diameter. So we have 12 meter diameter. So we're not going to use the diameter, but we're going to get the radius. So the radius of of 12 is half of your diameter. So the half of 12, you get 6. Okay, so 6 meters. So again, we're going to write the formula. Area is equal to pi r squared. Then we're going to write the value of pi, which is 3.14. Okay. Multiply by the radius 6 and another radius 6. So we're going to write again 3.14. 6 times 6, we get 26 at 36. Okay, and then we're going to multiply again vertically. Okay. So 6 times 4, that is 24. Every 2, 6 times 1, that is 6 plus 2, we get 8. 6 times 3, we get 18. 3 times 4, we get 12. Every 1, 3 times 1, that is 3 plus 1, we get 4. And 3 times 3, we get Nine. And we're going to forget again the two product. So we have four, ten, carry one. We have thirteen, carry one, and eleven. So we have two decimal places. Again, we're going to move two places going to the left. So our uh, area here for number three is. 113 and 4 tenths meter square. Okay, so that is how we find the, the area of a circle. By using the formula, area is equal to pi r squared, or we can say that area is equal to pi times r times r. Thank you for listening.